Today, we... I'm going to draw the train that we went on. Okay. Today, we went panning for gold in the USA. It took us two planes to get to Montana in the USA. Then a long car ride to get to Virginia City in the USA. Rosie, they're both in the USA. I know. That's Dan. He's dressed like cowboys were in the old days. He showed us how to pan for gold. Shall we learn how to pan? Yeah. Yeah. Dan showed us how cowboys used to shovel dirt out of the creek and put it into a gold pan. Then he showed us how to shake the pan back and forth to separate the gold from the other rocks. We weren't finding anything. But the cowboys didn't always find gold either. Guess what they never found up here? What? The mother load. You know what a mother load is? Yeah, like a whole the big whole bunch. The whole big deposit. Rosie, let's keep looking. Buy lots of gold. And guess what? Holy cow. Gold. I think we're rich. Dan told us that cowboys used to ride this huge old steam engine to Nevada City to trade the gold they found for other things. We wanted to try riding the train like the cowboys did. So we caught a lift on an old stagecoach. Hi, DJ. Hi, guys. You want to go for a stagecoach ride? OK. OK. Whoa. When we finally got up, we got to yell the horses' names to get them to go. People used to use stagecoaches to get them around in the old days. It's a lot bumpier than a car. Yeah, but lots of fun. Bye, Bye BJ. Bye, guys. At the train station, we met Bobby. She's the engineer of this old steam engine. Do you know how much this old train weighs, Rosie? As much as an elephant? Way more. It weighs 83,000 pounds. That's like eight elephants. It's so cool. Can you reach? Sounds like an elephant, too. Oh, Lord. How does the steam engine work? When I pull that throttle, that steam from the water we fill with the fire goes into a steam cylinder, and that steam cylinder makes the wheels go round. to Nevada City, there was nobody there. Nevada City was a real town. There were over 9,000 people that lived here. Now we have nothing but ghosts. They call it a ghost town because nobody lives there anymore. Rosie, where'd you go? Rosie? Rosie? Boo! Rosie! We took pictures of ourselves pretending to be ghosts. Julie and I put our best ghost faces on for the camera. Good ghost face, Mom. Nowadays, cowboys work on ranches with horses. That's our friend Karina. She's going to take us horseback riding at her ranch. But we couldn't figure out who was going to get the window seat. So we settled it the cowboy way. Go ahead, Rosie. It's time to play. Is sitting by the window worth getting all wet?
drove out to the countryside. The mountains were huge. We saw lots of animals on the way to Karina's ranch. And even more animals when we got there. They're not animals. That's Ty and Brand. This is how you do it. This is how you do it. They showed us how to throw a lasso. <laughs> <laughs> well, sort of. Cowboys use lassoes to catch cows that have gone away from the herd. And you do it. Sorry, it takes practice. Oh, man, it's a lot harder than it looks. But we kept trying. And guess what? Woo! Way good roping! <laughs> They are. They are my favorite animal. Do you want to know what my favorite animal is? What's your favorite animal? It is a shark and a polar bear. Really? Why do cowboys say yee Why do they say yee It's kind of, it, it's the cowboy form of uh, a yelling. Yee-haw! Ready for mine? Yeah. yee Nice. We had a great time being cowboys and cowgirls. In the USA. Hey guys. Hey Kina. Hey, before you leave, you want to go roast some s'mores over a bonfire? Reach out my arms. Oh, me say yo. Oh, me tell you to run. S'mores. Well, pick me up with golden hand. Oh, me say yo. Bye. 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 Bye.